Yo, what is going on everybody? It's your boy Blank here, bringing you another GTA 5 online tutorial. And in this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to bring story mode vehicles into GTA 5 online. So, first of all, what you're going to need to do is just come to a nice open area where there's like a road nearby, because you're going to need to get a car later on in the steps. So, um, just... Once you get to this uh, a nice area, I'm choosing this little area because I don't know. There's a little road next to it and um, a nice little field. So once you come up, once you get to this location, just come over to like and like the spot that you want to um, bring the car to, and then um, just make sure that your spawn location is set to last location, and then um, just leave GTA Online. So then wait up, wait for the cinematic to happen. Um, that will happen every time you leave GTA Online. And then uh, just once you've done that, just click down on the D-pad and go to your online character. And then some alerts will come up and stuff. Just click it. So once that's happened, just go to the street and um, steal a car. Any car, it doesn't matter. And then all you're going to want to do then is just drive it back to... Um, the uh, area where you were stood when you left GTA Online. So now you, ha so now I have a vehicle. I'm just going to drive it over to the area where I left GTA Online and make uh, make note that like of where you park it because you're going to need to park the vehicle in story mode in exactly the same place. So once you've parked it, just go to click start, go to the uh, Xbox Game Store or PSN if you're on PS3. And then that's where you're going to want to either disconnect from the internet by plugging in an ethernet cable, pulling out your ethernet cable or turning off your ruler. And then some alerts will come up and then just click A for all of them. And then you will be put back into um, story mode. So once the story mode loads up and the cinematic happens, just... You, th this is where you want to um, load up the game save which you have the vehicle that you want to bring into online so that's what I'm gonna do I see I load up th that game save there and then I'm just gonna fast forward that part so as you can see I'm doing it with a tow truck and um, yeah so this is where you want to drive to the location where you left GTA online park the other car and so I'll meet you there. So now we're here. Um, just pack it up in roughly the same area as you parked the other car in online and where you left GTA Online for the first time. And then you just want to go to online and then either connect to Xbox Live again or just sign in. And then just click go on online and then that'll come up it'll say you have missing content so then once you just load up that um, just go down to the business update and then just confirm the purchase for that it will not take long at the most it'll take like 20 seconds depending on your download speed but um, no. So it's going to say like 5, 4, ok well it did it already, so yeah, just wait for the online to load up and then once you spawn in online just go to where you was, where you parked the tow truck or whatever vehicle you are doing it with and then it will be there. So that is about it guys, if you did enjoy this video or if it was helpful at all then please remember to leave a like and if you are new then do subscribe. I love all. Peace.